What's up, YouTube? I'm not gonna say backwards in the video because everybody says that. Mm, but I am back. Today we're gonna do the hair hair wash video that I promised you guys a long time ago. I know. I'm sorry. Um. So I just took some braids out of my head that I had in for maybe a week. But braids don't really last long. And my hair, hopefully for y'all, is different. So y'all don't have to spend as much money. But, I don't know. So, let's get started. Um, I'm going to put this on me so that... Don't get my clothes wet. Um, yeah, I guess a little cape or whatever. Um, the first thing I'm gonna do is part my hair. Um, my parts are never even. I wasn't good in geometry. That's not even freaking geometry. That's just being symmetric. I think that's the way it is. Okay. And guess what I don't have? My scrunchies. Hold on. Okay. Now I have my scrunchies. So I'm gonna put my hair in four sections. And basically what I'm gonna do is pre-pull my hair, which basically I just wet it with a spray bottle. And I put some conditioner and oil in it. And you're supposed to do this before you wash your hair and let it sit for like 30 to 45 minutes. It's basically like, I know that, well, I don't know. Okay, so like shampoo really does dry your hair out. So like doing the pre-poo before is like so that when you do shampoo your hair, it doesn't just like take all the moisture and oil out of your hair. Okay, so just take your first section, come on please, and just spray. Just spray and kind of detangle. Please never ever detangle your hair while it's dry. I'm probably not going to have any hair. Well, I'm not going to say not going to have any hair, but. But your hair probably is going to fall out. I know that I did with my oil. Okay, anyway, so the type of conditioner, conditioner that I use is the Whole Blends by Garnier. I use the Maple Remedy with castor oil and maple extracts um it smells good yeah so you just take a little not a lot just a little and you put it on your hair Okay, maybe a little more. Um. Okay, so then I'm using castor oil. I always use castor oil because of the simple fact that my conditioner has castor oil in it. So... And you just leave that in there and braid it. <clears throat> I 
and then you just repeat with the other three sections of your hair. <laughs> Okay, so now I'm just gonna put my little cup on. And just let it sit for like 30 minutes, 45. Try not to go to sleep. All right, so I don't know why I did that. That's really corny. Anyways, I'm back. So, it's been sitting in my head for about 45 minutes. I had my timer set for 30, but then my friends called. Y'all know how that go. Um, so, basically, you just undo your braids. Okay, so <clears throat> after I take my braids down, I just kind of comb through to make sure, like, that it's not tangled. Because, like, once you put your hair under the water and it's already tangled, it just tangles it even more, I guess. Then get, like, knots and all that. Okay, so now I'm about to wash my hair and put conditioner in it. I'm not gonna wash the conditioner out though because I need to deep condition my hair. So. Okay, so I just washed my hair. Um, now it has conditioner in it. And um, I'm just coming through it with the conditioner in it. I'm gonna put some oil in it because my hair is really dry. So I like to keep oil in it. Um, the shampoo that I use is the same type of conditioner, um, the Hoblins Maple Remedy with castor oil and all that stuff. Um, I'm going to put some more conditioner because I just don't feel like it's enough. Open up, I'm trying to put your heart together, found it broken up. Going up a smoke, smoking up. Make sure the children in the house, she's inappropriate. The way she's approaching us, I disassociate. Exfoliate, the renegotiate. She's closing up. Come to visit me, she say that she the loneliest. And it's hard to open up. Open you up like a puck ball. Open up, tear you out for a puck ball. Let your emotions walk, fall on me. Open up. You OPN, hit you on BBM. We should be closer than friends. If you OPN, engaging you's on my agenda. Request my chariot to get ya. The doors OPN, take that high road and hop in. Open up. All right, so I just washed the conditioner out of my hair. <clears throat> I'm going to tie this back up because it likes to fall off. Um, I use shirts to dry my hair, 
um shirts are not as harsh on your hair as towels are um so yeah you shirts okay so i decided that I'm gonna do a twist up. And hopefully it comes out right. Cause if not, I'ma be mad. I'ma be mad. But I have to out. I really want my hair to dry some more before I start twisting it or the twist aren't gonna come out right. Okay, anyways, so I'm going to raise my scalp. This is some grease that I made, and it needs to be mixed because all the oil is sitting on top. Um, I need my comb. Okay, so... I hate hair in my face. It's like a pet peeve. So I really do want my hair to dry some more before I start to twist it. Because if it's too wet when I start twisting it, then I don't know. It doesn't look right. And my hair shrinks up really bad. So yeah. Um, in this oil, you don't. In this grease, it is. Oh, okay. So it has do grow, which is like a grease for your hair. Um, sulfur eight, castor oil, and wild growth oil. Since I've been using this contraction, I, I saw it on the internet, actually. That's how I really started using it. I saw it. Somebody posted it on Facebook or whatever. So I was like, hey, why not? But since I started it, since I've started using it, my hair has got like thicker, I guess. Because I used to have, well, my hair is thin, but like it's getting thicker. Because it used to be really really thin so my hair is getting thicker like me thick so yeah and uh, this is how i don't want my hair to look tomorrow um i had a really cute curl pattern but then i bleached my hair so i don't think my hair really liked that Mm -mm. Now I could put it in the ponytail. And I could put it in the bun. I got my edges back. I haven't got my edges back yet. I wore a frontal for prom. And little old me was being impatient when I was taking it down. And I put my edges out. Trying to hurry up and take it down. Because I wanted to go out. So, yeah, that's what happened to my edges. Don't talk about me, though, because I still got her. So, it don't matter. Pew. All right, so I'm going to just do a twist on. I'm going to go through, grease my scalp. Oh, so, like, as a curl activator or whatever, 
I use Lotta Body, the Curl and Style Milk. It smells so good, y'all. Like, I get so many compliments when I wear this. Everybody be like, your hair smells so good. And it doesn't, like, leave your hair coated, I guess. And your hair doesn't really feel heavy compared to other products that do leave your hair feeling like that. So, I'm about to a party and twist it. Once again, my parts don't get straight because symmetric, not geometry. I'm going to do bigger twists today. I don't know why out of all days I want to try something new, but whatever. I'm just doing bigger than I usually do. Well, really? I don't know. But... Okay, so I finished these twists. I'm gonna take them out tomorrow whenever it's time for my photo shoot. Hopefully my hair act right. I was finna put on a bunny and take a nap, but my kids wanna go to the mall. So I'm finna throw on a hat and let it do what it do. See y'all tomorrow. Okay, so today is the day of my photo shoot. Um, I untwisted my hair earlier. It didn't really look good, I guess. I don't know. I usually have no problems with my twist outs. And then out of all days, it's going to look a mess today. So I just wet it and then put some lot of body in there. And then just lay my little edges down or whatever. So, about to go. Thank y'all for tuning in. Be on the lookout for my next video.